is up? Put this off my screen. Anyway, yo, what is up? Welcome back to another episode of Watchless, hosted by yours truly, Ashro Gagamati, aka Monkey, aka KBT, aka whatever the fuck you want to call me. And today, we got some CJ the Champ on the channel. You feel me? Nah, I've seen people loving CJ the Champ shit. Um, I've even watched some, a couple of his stuff. Um, this one specifically, um, Roberta the Terminator. I see, hey, the views speak for itself. It, it sound it sound like it's lit. We're gonna get into it, man. Nah, uh, yo, what is up? Welcome back to another episode of Watch List, hosted by yours truly, Ashro Kagimari. No, I'm using this. I'm using this. I'm stupid. Yo, what is up? Welcome back to another episode of Watch List, hosted by yours truly, Ashro Kagimari, aka Modern Kid, aka KBT, aka whatever the fuck you wanna call me. And today, we got. So she did a champ on the channel. Uh, you feel me? Like I ain't gonna hold you. Like I'm, I'm kind of excited. I ain't, I ain't watched this one. I've been watching she did a champ. That's my guy. You feel me? This one in particular. Hey, the views speaking for themselves is going cool. So we gonna, we gonna see what's going on. You gonna see what's going on. Let's get into it, man. All right. So look, look, look let me, give me a second. Give me a second. Give me a second. So homeboy pull up again. And he's like, huh. I know exactly who you are now. You're the bloodhound of Florencia. And it's my lucky day because the cartel got a four million dollar bounty on your head right now. But she just looks at him and says, sorry, but I must leave you gentlemen. Please take these as a parting gift. Oh, shit. Ladies and gentlemen, it is finally yeah, time to watch the kind of slide, streets man. of Rwanda, the home of gang violence, pirates, mercenaries, and probably uh, every pirates, goddamn uh, mafia you can probably you think of. This is none other than the Black Air Force crockpot. So as expected, there is a new challenge mm, approaching to the round pot. table of Black Air Force activity, and it's okay. none other than a maid. I beg your pardon? Yeah, yeah maid. this absolute f***ing demon, this literal society. The yeah. Bloodhound of Florence, so like, the I definition of do not judge a book don't, by its cover. This, is, yeah, not this is not a maid. This is a Terminator. Like, I, I would not be surprised if somebody said this is a T-something model. So y'all already know we got the evidence on deck, and it is finally time to observe the maid uh, from hell. So without further ado, hell. exhibit A. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I now present to you Probably exhibit yes. A. The now he go now, he go madness. now, he ain't go. So the I'm Lagoon Company stopping. ended up taking this job from the Colombian Mafia. And with this job, they have to transfer this boy named Garcia. Now you see, Garcia okay. isn't an ordinary kid because Lil Jit right here is the son to one of the 13 great families of South America. So Reggie keeps on harassing the little nigga. So then he says, oh, you must think this real funny, huh? Just wait till my <laughs> maid comes. So yeah, she started right. laughing her ass off. She like, <laughs> the f that bitch gonna do wash the dishes, nigga. But then he says, well, you see, she's not that good at cleaning or cooking. And when it's we used to arm wrestle all the time, I always used to beat her. But one time when we was arm That's wrestling, the mafia pulled up and her games, arm so. wouldn't even move. Damn. Oh my God, that bicep. <laughs> so Roberta ends up pulling up to Rowanna for to find Garcia. So when she gets there, she goes around and starts asking people. Nah, she. Yeah. That shit is basically my shit, dude. Yeah, you, know, you feel country. me? Like, I would like to have a word. That shit basically my shit. And these, cause like, you want to know where the Colombian mafia is at? You got to be out of your damn mind. But she's like, I just want to have a word. That's all. So while nah, this yeah, is happening, nah. we cut to Bella nah, Laika. Bad, so homie right here, like, come red Bella Laika. You should take a look at this. Shit. So it gives her this picture and she's like, hold on, wait a damn minute. Comrade, this ain't no damn maid. Look at them eyes. Oh, she got that dog in her. So now we cut to the bar. So we're both Okay, she do got that dog in her. We just seen so it. So when they pull up, they like, hey, bitch, heard you were snooping around the fuck you want a bullet, nigga. So she ends up breaking her glass. So then she gets up and she's like, yes, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Roberta of the Lovelace family. Now, please tell me where my master is. I would not like this to get violent. Well, this 
start laughing their ass off. They like, <laughs> the what? What you gonna so do? Throw a dish? Crazy. So it's then she killing starts me, lifting up her umbrella. So then she says, "Well, looks like I'm just gonna have to air this bitch out then." You what? Bow. Bow. Hello. Oh my god. So they like, hey, nigga, show that bitch. So they start blasting and she enters the matrix. So after Ooh, they stop okay, that was like, clean. Y'all got stormtrooper aim. Allow me to show you my new aimbot I just installed. So she started going crazy. Bam. Ooh. Ooh. Everybody get pellets in the ass. Boss. So as she Skidoosh. continues to air the entire bar out, Goon could be taking cover under this table and Dutch like, damn, why do we always get stuck with these stupid ass jobs? But then Revy starts crawling over and then the bartender sees her. And look at him, he's like, I swear to God, if you was the one who brought all these niggas up in my damn bar, bitch, I hope you have insurance. So then she everything bad. just goes she quiet. Is bad. Like, she is so bad. Hold back there, like, hey, the f Lagoon Company, hey, the f is my package at? And Dutch is like, nah, OG, the deal's off. I ain't messing with that maid over there. So Roberta sees Garcia, she's like, ah, oh, Master Garcia, come now, my boy. It is time to go home. Who are these people? Do they need to be eliminated? So then Revy grabs him. She's like, ah, 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 stop, bitch. So Roberta's like, hmm, you dead threaten the young master. So homeboy right here try to sneak her, but then she hits him with the reverse no scope. Uh, oh my God. Oh, that's dude, nasty. Right? She is like, like, like bro, that. Like, so then she's like, she just mm, built very different. well then. So you have chosen death. Time to put your ass that. six feet on the Do bitch. So she starts oh. lighting it up with oh, the briefcase. The briefcase. And then she hit it with the noob tube. Oh a my god. A nuke in the briefcase? Shorty she is built different. Cold. She just really Damn, packed up Revy in the her amount up. of 10 seconds. Nah, bro, she so then he trying dirty, to bro. dip and she even <laughs> Garcia, he's like, please, God, take me <laughs> with you. Like, so Roberta just drops some. Nah, she, nah she's bro, that's, that's disrespectful. Couldn't be me, bro. Couldn't be me. So homeboy pull up again and he's like, huh. I know exactly who you are now. You're the Bloodhound of Florencia. And it's my lucky Blood day because the cartel got a phone. Uh, that ain't gonna lie. That shit just rolled right off the now. tongue too but smoothly when I just said says, that. that was Sorry, cool. but I must leave you, gentlemen. Please take these as a parting gift. Oh, shit. Boom. 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 No, uh, bro. So Lagoon Company what dipping they home. bro? Great heavens, look at this absolute demon. Bro? She is unscathed and she is hitting the Sephiroth pose right now. And she breaks this window with no effort. This That's is the Terminator. So about five minutes later, while they driving, she done already caught up. Is she whipping that hoe? God damn. So Dutch pulls out the gun and starts trying to shoot her. But she drives up, grabs this by the arm and starts pulling him out of the car. Yeah, they looking at me hitting on everything, but she just e that shit. Okay. She's not even flinching. But her car finally breaks down, so they finally get a chance to escape. But this did not last long at all. Cause about a minute later, she is whipping that hoe on the roof. Nothing. So she jumps down and crashes into him and uses her aimbot to take out their wheel. So she crashed into this building, but she breaks out of the car. You surviving car crashes like that? <laughs> she won the wrong scene. She you take your ass car? fast and furious. What y'all old Vin Diesel ass? <laughs> and look at this run. Oh my God. She tracking that hoe down with that CW flash ass run. Man, she's not even so she injured. So these things out and jumps onto like, the car. All. So Dutch like, she's ooh, nigga, I'm about to shoot this what bitch. What the? And he starts blasting, but she whips she on demon, top bro. of the nah, car. Bro, she pulls demon. out the dualies and starts going <laughs> oh, crazy on the bro. roof. So they end up she going over to the shipping yard. And she gets cracked by this cone. So they end up what? crashing, and it looks like she's finally out. So they look over again, and she is gone. And she is back ready for more smoke. So Revy finally wakes up and she's like, damn, that bitch really pulled the noob tube on my ass. I should up? return the favor. I'm immersed so now, they start like, standing off for their final fight. So oh, Revy nah, says, nah, make a goes. move, bitch. Then Roberta says, shut the fuck up, you nasty bitch. I can smell your dirty ass all the way from here, you stain booty hoe. So they start blasting and this goes on for like, nah. God knows how long. It was dark when they started and it's almost morning. Like how much ammo do y'all have? So later on, she ended up putting a bullet they in Revy's shoulder. 
I'm looking at you like, I swear to God, I'm gonna put a bullet in your little googly eyed ass. So they come out shooting and Whoever start running at each other. So they end up hitting each, each other. other. So they both down and they about to shoot, but Balalaika ends up stopping them. She's like, all right, ladies, let's cut out the bush. <laughs> she done brought the whole Russian mafia with her. So she walks up and says, you know, I gotta thank you, Miss oh May. Oh my God, she I was got going to deal with her. the cartel today, but <laughs> guess nah, you done already did that. Exactly so she up. shoots the guns out of both their hands and Yo. grabs one. Then she says, all right, Miss Bloodhound, you could go home now. So Garcia's like, Bloodhound? What do you mean by that? And she says, oh, you didn't know? So she tries to stop and she's like, ah, 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 shut the f up for a buster cap in your ass, n So let me tell y'all, this so-called maid is the bloodhound of Florencia. Oh my, she is unnecessary a literal Cuban ass super soldier, and she is wanted in every single country in the world. So Garcia's like, hold on, is Blood this true? Florencia. She's like, yeah, it's all Cuban true. I've killed hundreds, probably thousands, glooshed up, and so many unthinkable things. Huh. I'm an international menace to society. So she's like, my bad young master. I did not mean to deceive you, but it was for your own safety. But Revy's like, nah, f that sob story shit. What am I gonna do with this bullet in my arm? So they like, oh, you right. So uh, y'all can settle it with some bare knuckle boxing. So they about to scrap. So before they start, Roberta says, hey, your shoes untied. Huh? Damn! Send her ass to the stratosphere. So they start going crazy. They boxing. And they over here taking best like, I got a full house on Revy. Huh. I'm going all in on the yeah, nigga. So they ended up boxing for like an hour and they just <laughs> knocked each other out. So after this, they leave and going she stupid. vows to never going off anybody stupid. ever again. And well, uh, huh. that promise yeah. didn't go so well. Because what we just saw was mild compared to what we were about to oh, witness. Up. So that was exhibit A and it is finally time to move on to exhibit B. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I now present to you exhibit B, vengeance and rip what? and tear. So she, about a year the later, word already? on the street is that Roberta is back. Cause somebody saw somebody in a maid outfit. So while Rock and Revy are at the bar, Yo. this maid comes up, but it's not Roberta, it's this girl named Fabiola. So she walks up to him and says, Master Garcia needs your help. But then homie behind her picks her up and he's like, all right, listen, little lady, uh, where is the actual real maid at? She ends up stabbing this nigga in the sweet heavens so she takes everybody over to garcia so then he says all right listen up everybody i need your help you see my maid has gone off the walls again so what had happened was garcia's dad mr lovelace ended up getting assassinated Nickel. by some americans Why? so obviously this didn't sit well with roberta because that was basically her father figure because mr lovelace ended up taking in roberta after she was on the run that's why she poses as a maid so this ended up waking up her inner demon again. And now she is slowly losing her sanity. So they showed them these pictures and there were six people that helped conspire with this assassination. So we cut over to one of the dudes and Roberta is she back got behind him and stalking him. So he runs away and tries to call one of the people on the phone, but Roberta nah, answers the bro, phone. She got bangs, She's like, my, bro. my, I've been looking for you, buddy. And don't try to call your other friends because <laughs> I've already paid them a visit too. And about a day <laughs> uh, later, homie's body was found dead and disfigured in a canal. Her next target what? was homeboy oh, right here. Time. So nah, she, she got him chained up on this thing and he like, do you know who I am? And she like, yes, demon I know exactly time. who you are, Mr. American. Now you best start talking before your ass start cooking. And yo, she is guzzling down She chopping them hoes like Tic Tacs. Oh, she and she like, come on now, shit. chop, chop, speak up, nigga. And later that day, homie was found dead. And the only suspect, was a woman in a maid outfit. So later on, we cut back to the bar and Roberta pulls up in the bar. Then she says, there's a war coming. Please point me to How every is single she weapon shop in this city. Please doing that. So the bartender like, oh, hell no. Nah. Nah, then bro. she breaks the glass and she's like, do you think I'm As joking? Uh, that, now hurry up before I make cold, you a pack. Man. So the Americans are in town and everybody in the hood going crazy. Cause all hell is about to break loose. Random gangsters and bounty hunters, Revy and her crew, the CIA and the cartel, all okay. because of one person, Roberta. 
So now later that evening, the gangsters try to pull up on the Americans, but they end up lighting them up. They say we rep the US of A in this motherfucker. So they end up escaping to the roof and there is a sniper on this the other wild, side. Bro. And it is none other than Roberta with the yeah, very 50 the cow. Day. She Damn. started unloading on them. And she got the new 2-4 sidearm. So then the other dudes come in and try to third party her. But she third, starts oh, no scoping them with oh, one hand. Down, she bad. is using a 50 cal with one hand. Oh my Jesus, face up. The face were better in this bitch. And then she ends up pole vaulting all the way to another building. But look one. at the dudes right here. They like, bruh, what did we sign up for? So now it's nightfall and the Americans are on the run. And the bloodhound is on the ass. She's not a pole so she gets on the ground and starts smelling the ground. Bro, she's like, what? I smell bitch. So no she gets up way. in this room and she's like, hmm, I should prepare. I should use this hanger as a weapon. So Garcia ends up running in behind her and then he just sees the <laughs> absolute <laughs> carnage that she I has just that left shit. behind. Come. So these dudes see this guy and they like, hey, bro, what's happening, bro? And well, uh, guess who's behind them? Hello. So she ends up beating the life out of these dudes with her bare hands. So then this weirdo comes up and he's like, hmm, looks like the bloodhound is more ferocious than ever. So they start boxing. Oh he he low-key kind of boxing Dude. her up right now. So then he slams her on this table. And then, yo, yo, some weird ass shit happens right here i ain't even gonna lie to you bro you know i'm blacking the screen out because i all you just gotta know is some uh Hercules, Hercules, Hercules. if you get my drift yo this man garcia is out here watching this oh my god this is terrible so why they getting freaky he said all right you know what to do next and she's like yeah yeah i got you with some bullets <laughs> Yo, she really had a gun in the belt buckle. Then she said, you thought we was gonna get nasty with your dirty ass. So then she starts beating the life out of this man. She throwing him around like a rag doll and everything. So then Garcia yells, yo, please stop. And yo, her hand went through his entire skull. So then she's like, oh my God. Oh my God, I did not just do that in front of the young master. But then she's like, wait a minute. The young master shouldn't be here. You are an illusion. You are a lie. So she is about to shoot this little nigga. But then the Americans come in and save him. So then this even sets her off even more. She's like, oh my God. Now they took the young master? They will all bleed and die. So then later on, Revy and her crew pull up. So then old girl tries to run up and attack her. But she bites her sword in half. Then old girl comes in with the chainsaw and she breaks the chainsaw. So then homie come up right here, but. <laughs> so then Bro, I, am, I, I, I got her, nothing to say. Says, what are we yo, talking about? She just broke a, a sword with her teeth. She just broke a chainsaw like, with two, oh my God. With two, with a she has to marry her fucking lost hands her right mind. Like, what are we so talking now about? Roberta's She's chasing them down on a motorcycle and Bella Laika's up on top of the roof with the Russians. Then she starts talking to the Americans like, looks like you Americans could not get the job done. So allow us to finish it. So they end up shooting multiple RPGs at her. And that finally ended up slowing her down. So the Americans Something hitch a ride with right Lagoon now. Company to retreat. But also, guess who's still hot on their tail? So Roberta got this plane ticket. So she sits down by the lady and the lady says, damn, you smell like ass. Looks like you found that ticket I left you. And this is none other than our favorite nun, Etta. The one that'll like to block up in the name of Jesus. But she's actually a double agent for the CIA. So she tries to swing on her. She's like, hold on, shawty, chill. I'm just trying to help you out. That's all. So she's like, hmm, fine. But after my hunt is complete, I will reward you with a painless death. So now it's the next day and they're in this jungle. So they head off. So when they get out to the land and they start scouting it, they start to see rocks spread out around the land. And yo, you're seeing yo, Fabiola yo, yo, yo. like, oh, these she, ads she already here. Gonna blow she about bro. to make this a like, dead by daylight, Bobby. And boy, oh boy, was he right because she was about to make this a horror Back movie. Cause with this scenery, she done turned into the predator. So she grabs this hostage and takes off. 
Then she stops, cuts off his ear, and then goes into the jungle. It's up, bro. It's up. Me personally, so she pops I probably have a better chance of being in the gun. Then kicks his head off and then retreats. So then she finds these other three dudes. So she pops Tommy with the musket, and then they finally realize, oh my God, those rods are literally her bullets. She placed them there for them to see what they were gonna get killed by. Then she runs up on this dude and pops him right in his face. But then she ends up getting hit by a claymore. And then she ends up getting sniped. But she ate that and she is still moving. Oh my God, what the fuck is she made of? She just ate a claymore and a bullet and is still moving. But she ended up losing some fingers. So she's like, hmm, I don't need these shits. So then she just flings them off and just acts like nothing happened. So now she's moving in the bushes, so she sneaks homie in the back. So then she picks up his walkie talkie and she's like, mm -mm -mm, You all are dropping like flies. Make this at least a little entertaining for me. So then bro with the ponytail started running at her, but she chucks the whole <laughs> gun at him. And she's like, Hear my war cry. But then she ends up seeing Garcia and he's like, yo, please just stop. But she's still losing her mind. She's like, you are not the young master, you are the enemy. But then he basically has to take a whole bullet to believe that it's him. So she finally just stopped and dear God, thank the Lord. Like, bro, just look at her, she is beat the f up. So after all of her carnage, she now getting pushed around in a wheelchair. She done lost a leg, an arm, half a hand, an eye, half a hair. And look at her, she's still like, I still killed him on God. So yeah, with all that evidence sit down, there's no discussion, there's no argument. This damn Terminator, Predator, Doom Guy ass, she took on the USA, Russia, the cartel, Colombian special forces. God knows <laughs> what fact. she did in her I was thinking the same story. thing. I'm like, she's still on the same the bullshit that she nah, was sit down. always on. So yeah, that's it. Uh, like, I ain't no way she, she just sit back. Like, if something so yeah, happens, bro, she definitely it, uh, still a fucking your boy demon time. On Twitter. Make sure y'all sub to the second channel. I'm finally cooking over there again. And uh, I am out of here. Yeah, bro. G O D. I go. Hold you. She is O D. Like really O D. I think I'd rather buy. I ain't gonna hold you. I'd rather like I take my chances with Doflamingo. I might be able to talk some sense into him. You feel me? That is me personally. But um, yeah. Thank you for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit the post notification bell so you always know when I post. Comment down below. Anything else you want to see me react to? Your favorite part of the video? If I should watch this on the channel? St stuff like that. You feel me? Um, we do got some more watch lists coming up. So look forward to that. But other than that, I'll see y'all later, man. <laughs>